Hello everyone, welcome back. So in this video, we are going to be discussing about another really interesting but simple topic that is about the unit of rainfall. So normally whenever you are watching some weather forecasts or news, so you might have heard that normally the rainfall is measured in millimeters and it's displayed that, for example, the rainfall is one millimeter. So the question is that what does this mean actually? Like we're not going to be talking about how the rainfall is measured. But your concern here that how would we imagine about the extent of the rainfall by looking at the unit of the rainfall like that, like one millimeter of rainfall. So let's see that. And it's really easy. And if you watch this video, so by the end of the video, you would be able to easily, um, easily imagine that what would one millimeter or whatever the rainfall is in your area, what would that mean? You would know about that, right? Okay, so before that, let's first of all see some examples even. If you go to Google from a rainfall, average, average rainfall, let's say. So you would know that even that's measured in millimeters or inches, right? So it's really weird to see this, that the rainfall is measured in millimeters and if you imagine or if you try to think about it, what would that actually mean? That 885 millimeter of rainfall, right? So let's let's see that. So the answer to this is that one millimeter of rainfall actually means one liter per meter square of rainfall. So this is actually equal. And even if you sort out the units here, you would get it back. Like if you try to convert the liter into millimeter and cancel the units there you would get it back in form of 1 mm let's see let's do that so for example 1 liter is equal to 1 divided by 1000 meter cube so we can put it there 1 divided by 1000 meter cube and then eventually the meter cube would cancel out with the square here right so you would get meter there and there you will get uh, 1 by 1000 right so 1 by 1000 meter from here and then if you convert the meter into millimeters, so one meter equals a thousand millimeters, so thousand would cancel with thousand and you would get one mm. So it means that whenever you see one millimeter of rainfall, it means that this is the rainfall in one square meter of an area in liters, right? So one mm of rainfall would mean one liter of rainfall in one square meter of an area. So I hope that I hope that now you will be able to imagine about the extent of the rainfall whenever it's displayed in news or in any weather forecast that you're watching. So it's simple, right? Mm of rainfall means the liter per square meter of an rainfall it at any place. So thank you very much.